Oh, sorry, you're probably wondering what that is. That's a fireplace, but we're going to get to that later on in the video. Hi, I'm Steven Zarita. I'm the station manager at Texas Student Television, and this is the video newsletter for the month of November. So in the last month, we've got quite a few things we want to share with you, and those things are actually all sitting right here on top of this television. As you can see, we've won quite a few awards. Now, TSV already has a lot of awards from over the years, but this semester we won a lot more than usual, which we are extremely proud of. So just to go down the list of what we've won, at College Broadcasters Incorporated, we won Best Promo, which is extremely exciting. I may or may not have made that promo. I actually did, so that's extremely exciting for me. Over at South Central Broadcasting, Combo Breakers won first place in the video drama category. BJHL won first place in the Best Magazine program category. And Good Morning Texas won first place for Live Performance Segment category. All those are extremely exciting, and we also won second and third places for a lot of other categories as well. Moving back over to CBI, we got a finalist position for KVR's Zach Anner interview and for the production department's ACMC video. Back over at SCB, we also got finalist positions for College Press Box, KVR News, and Local Live. So we're extremely proud of all these awards and all the hard work that went into getting them, and we look forward to getting a lot more of these in the future. But looking back more than just the past month, but the entire fall of 2011 semester, we've got a lot of things that we're proud of. As we move on to our winter break, we're kind of looking back in retrospect, and we're extremely proud of the way all of the shows have grown in the past semester and all the volunteers that have stepped up. We're also extremely sad to see some of our senior volunteers leave, and it's always sad to see people graduate and go off into the real world, but we know that they're gonna do very well because we've had a lot of alumni that have done very well. One of those alumni is the former station manager here at Texas Student Television, and he came in to talk to us about what his current job is like and what he uses from his knowledge here at Texas Student Television there. My name is Taylor Rush, and I graduated in spring of 2011, and the last position that I held at TSTV was station manager for the year 2010 to th through 2011. My positions leading up to station manager were, you know, starting out obviously as a volunteer, working on the shows, doing whatever I needed to do, graphics, you know, whatever was asked of me. And then I transitioned into being the uh, producer of both College Press Box and College Crossfire. And from there I was able to be sports director in the spring of my sophomore year and then into my junior year as well. And then from being sports director, my next position was station manager in my senior year. Shooting sports was such a great experience uh, during my time at TSTV. Um, you know, I had no idea that coming into college during my time in college during those four years that I'd be going to a national championship game, the Fiesta Bowl, the College World Series of Baseball, um, and all that. So being able to do those things and having that opportunity through TSTV and being on the sidelines for those events is just an amazing opportunity that you're never going to get anywhere else. So my freshman year, I uh, had the opportunity to go shoot a press conference with the football team. And this was the first time I'd ever really gone out and done anything on my own, so it was, it was a really fun experience for me. But during, the, during that day, I uh, met a local photographer from uh, KXAN. His name's Todd Bynum. And uh, we talked a little bit that day, and uh, he ended up giving me an internship that year. So my freshman year, I answered to KXAN. And then over the years, I kept in touch with Todd, and, uh, which led to me getting my job now that I, that I have right now. And so that, that was really nice because, you know, there's a lot of people in the uh, who graduated with me who don't have jobs right now and having the opportunity to go out and meet somebody through TSTV that one day led to me having a job was just you know it was a great opportunity and something that is really one of the, the larger assets of TSTV is that you are out there with the professionals and you do get to meet those people and you get to network and you get to uh, make relationships that one day you can use to get a job in the future so that's nice. I think some of the hardships that comes with leading people is, you know, as a volunteer and as a producer, maybe you, 
you kind of do a lot of things on your own because you know you can do those things and you can know you can do them really well and that's how you rise to a leadership position is by doing stuff yourself. But when you get in that leadership position you have to lead others and you have to tr and trust, you know, and you have to trust others to do the things that you did before. And so that's one of the hard things to do is, is letting go and trusting that you have led others, you know, well enough that they'll be able to do it just as well as you did and hopefully even better. Because something I always said was that, you know, if it's not getting better after I left, then I didn't do my job. So that's, you know, one of the things that you sort of learn as a leader and uh, TSTV taught me. Right now, I am an editor at KXAN, which is the NBC affiliate in Austin. And uh, there, there are certainly a lot of similarities. I mean, the time constraints that you come across in the, in the industry. Um, getting stuff on the show, you know, when you get it five minutes before the show. Stuff like that, you know, that I learned at TSTV because, you know, sometimes, um, you know, you get in situations at TSTV where you need to get something on the air really quick and you got to turn it around really quick and it, it's a very high stress environment at times. And having the opportunity to, to experience a high stress environment and be able to work under those stresses really prepares you for the uh, real world whenever you're actually doing those things under real stress. The only closing thoughts I really have is, is just echoing what I would say to incoming freshmen is definitely come, make it your own, seize this opportunity that you have here because if you don't then you're just another uh, RTF graduate or broadcast journalism graduate who doesn't really have that much experience but coming here, getting that experience and you know, meeting some really great, amazing people along the way. It just, it really kind of, it changes your life. And uh, that sounds kind of like a profound statement or whatever, but it really does, and it, it's true. It changed mine, and uh, I'm sure it would change just about anybody who comes. Wow, sure sounds like Taylor's on fire. What else is on fire? This TV channel. That's right. We created a fireplace channel for all you Austinites on 29.3. So rescan your antennas and look for that channel. And you can enjoy a nice, vibrant fireplace that won't burn down your house accidentally all winter break. Speaking of winter break, even though our volunteers may be going home for the holidays, that doesn't mean TSTV is going to stop. We're going to keep up our programming and even introduce a couple new episodes of shows over the winter break so you can keep watching all winter long and those shows are also going to keep uploading content to their YouTube pages and our website so keep an eye on that and all of their social media to stay entertained this holiday season. So I hope you enjoy those presents and I hope you enjoyed this video. We'll see you again back in full force next year and it's not that far away but we'll miss you. Keep watching TSTV and have a happy holidays.